fuck? Bird offs herself to express her undying gratitude to you for saving her ass. I was... I was only gone an hour. How'd this happen? I don't know. I told you. Evie was lying in bed like always. When I went out. And I got back to... <laughs> Fuck. If I'd just known, I'd have... Checked your pulse? V... She's gone. Don't blame yourself. It won't solve anything. I should have sensed something. That it was off. <laughs> Stop. Couldn't watch you 24-7. She made up her mind. Would have found a way. Always. Gotta do something with her. Don't want any trouble. I'm calling the badges. Can you carry her to the bed? As if that'll change anything. Not sure we should move her before the badges get here. She's just another dead horde of them. Nobody will care. The least we can do is treat her with some dignity. Yeah, I, I need to report an accidental death. North side, Jackson Street. No. No imminent danger. <laughs> Suicide. Tomorrow? No! Today! What part of death don't you understand? No, she was not pronounced dead by trauma team. If she'd have had coverage, we wouldn't be talking. You don't want to move your asses. Why don't I come down to the precinct and trash it into bits? Now will you come and arrest me, you pussies? Fine, I don't give a fuck what you write me up for. <sighs> They'll be here soon. Told me to keep her on ice until tomorrow. Can you believe the balls? They're short on people. Have trouble keeping up. Big surprise. Who'd want to be a corpo fattened pig in Sty City? Put something on her. I'd rather she look like a person than a body. Did you wait outside? Close the door, V. Please. <sighs> Bum a cig. Didn't know you smoked. Quit. It's been years. But right now I need something besides air in my lungs. Please, V, just one. Here. That was her smoke case. Want to hold on to it? No. You seem to like it. Keep it. Kinda glad it's you that has it, actually. Fuck, Evie. I let her down. I thought if I gave her some t space or time, she'd get back on her feet. Can't wrap my head around it. I 
never saw Evelyn as the type to give up. Come on. What she went through? I wouldn't call it giving up. Remember Fingers? How he said Evie was with him for four days? Yeah. Did say so. She disappeared from clouds a week before you turned up. Tom told me later. Couldn't sleep at night knowing that. Kept thinking, what the hell happened to those other three days? So... I did some more digging in her virtues. Found Woodman. He kept her. And had his way with her. The things he did. And once he got bored, he pawned her off. Wait, so you found other recordings? Had another look at the corrupted ones. You know, lots of static. Hard to pick up anything, really. At some point, I stumbled on something like an echo of the spat we'd had last time we saw each other. But I know she wasn't scrolling. Then why was it saved as a virtue? Got no explanation for it. Maybe she recalled it later, relived it, almost. Implant could have been on when, you know, as a defense mechanism, escaping into the past so as not to live in the present. What did Woodman do to her? Did you see it? Yeah. And I really wish I could unsee it. I had no idea that guy was such a monster. I saw him as your average tricksy sleazebag. It puts on a convincing facade. I knew him, but I never thought him that sick in the brain. Gotta be something I can do about it. Like what? Don't know yet. Think I'll call Sue's. Thanks, V. Sorry, but uh, I'd rather be alone now. Promise to keep in touch. Sure you don't need anything? No, but sweet of you to ask. Anything comes up, holler on the hollow.
Hey, V. Thanks for showing. Talking with Maiko is like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. I'm ready. Let's go. Hold on. I'll open it. like that? No way you cracked it open on your first try. You know how to get around their systems? Appears so. I was hoping they hadn't run any updates since I left. Looks like I was right. Easy as paella. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yep, bet I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. You somehow never fail to lower my expectations. First you settle for the mocks, now murderers. I shudder to think what's next. Yes, V. I mean you. Came the clouds for info. Left with info. What happened in between is what happens when people refuse to work with you. Ever heard of a little something called compromise? Should try it sometime. Compromises take time I just don't have. Just what exactly are you after? Gonna go and harass another doll? Starting to think blowing hot air is all you're good at. A pathetic attempt at getting under my skin. What's next? Threats? Oh, we're not done talking. But you do well to hear Judy out. We'll make sure your worst fears come true. Oh. Stand to lose my youth, at ease, and influence? Something's gonna happen. But you'll be the last to know. Huh. I want to tear clouds out of the Tiger Claw's paws. Doll should own it. Control it. All right. This has been fun and all, but I think it's time you got going. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious, then sold her like she was so much scrap. Mess with the claws? Blowback will hit every one of the dolls in here. So, you won't help. I thought I expressed myself clearly. Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. You picked the wrong side, Maiko. I'll be the judge of that. That went. She didn't even let me make my point. Probably needs time to think. Couple of days, tops. Yeah, you might be right. I'll call her tomorrow. Have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. 
Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. And so was I. Can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. Lying between patting you on the back as their friend and planning knifing you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, used to have a big crush on her. Took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. <sighs> Just think, could have gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but I can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah, you, a deck chair and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella. Somehow I don't see it. No, me in a deck chair is me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. all you want, but at the end of the day, it says more about us than them. Biz is biz and tits are biz. It's like junk food. People don't buy it because they're gone. They're just poor. City bastards still haven't sent anyone to fix it. Watch your language. Can't you see who you're talking to? Please, what do you need? Well, we need the pipe fixed, that's for sure. Maybe something to fix up some of the enemies too. Thank you. Gotta get back to Michael with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough? Michael only works with specifics. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'm gonna talk to the dolls. I'll call you when I've got something. See you later, V. And thanks. How'd you manage that? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? Locust pepperoni. Lots of extra cheese. Atta boy. So, 
I'll see you come evening. Of course I'll be there. Hey V, come on in. Pizza's getting cold. We're in the kitchen. You made it, good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. Hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? So then, what's the plan? Need to wait for Michael. Feeling better? You look better. I'm on autopilot. I don't think. Just do. Sound method. You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? So, change your mind, huh? Quickly, too. I'm here. Doubt I need to explain why. All right, Shill. Not here to squabble with you. Wouldn't put it past you. Judy convinced you. Call me satisfied. Done saying hello to each other? Revolution won't plan itself. I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. You'll air it out later. Fine, I'll sit by the window. The body will react as if executing a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on top. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. All right. Gotta see it to believe it. Finally, someone said it. Tom? Pulled that sequence from a Kung Fu training virtue. Gotta admit, not bad. Yeah, for the market square in Kabuki. Uh, before we start talking serious biz, gonna need to see serious action. You just saw him. I saw a bar trick. I want to see a fight. Got an expert in causing bodily harm among us. 
I want to see how Tommy handles him. V? Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. It's on now! Come on, don't be a wuss! You there? Can you hear me? <laughs> Look at me go! You see that? Woo! Gotta do some cardio! Okay, okay. That probably sells it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. What now? Guards and tiger claws in and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out, clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead of you. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claws will just send more. Hiromi Sato is the man you gotta get to. It's a story about courage. Where do we find this Hiromi? At his apartment. H8 Mega Tower. Topmost floor. It's a penthouse. Almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. <laughs> yeah, plan just might work. Maiko, I take it you're on board too. Wouldn't be wasting my time here if I wasn't. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. I'm with it all the way. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores? V, Count get me it together. in, Judy. I already said I'd help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Save the gratitude for later, please. Oh. I'll set up the meet with Hiromi and let you know. I need a couple days. Have fun. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. I feel a migraine coming on. Oh, shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do, well usually comes with a price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. Judy? For real? No, don't want to hear it. But ep, ep, ep. Not a word. <laughs> uh, <sighs> v, everything okay? V? You don't, you don't. Uh, uh, okay. Okay, I'm better. Fine. What the hell, V? You, like, sick? Remember the heist Evelyn hired us for? The relic I was gonna clep. <sighs> Couldn't forget that in a million years. That biochip. Well, long story short. It had Johnny Silverhand's mind on it. An engram of it that's overriding my mind. You being serious? Truly wish I wasn't. Fuck. Anything at all you can do? One can hope. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Sounds great. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home.
Didn't know she dabbled in robotics. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. Huh. Interesting. Place looks like a fucking antique museum. Then I guess you should feel right at home. Chick's got taste. That all you have to say? And she's nice. Six out of ten. Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. All right, we going in? Let's do this. Straight to clouds. About fucking time. Stay sharp. Gangoons might be lurking. Soldier, not a fucking handyman. Someone there?
What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at Clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. But first, you gotta get into the penthouse. Okay, on my way. Elevator's on the other side. Be safe. became trapped deep underground following a high magnitude earthquake. All right, I'm moving. Jump down onto the balcony. Careful though, okay? You? What you calling me? That's right, I'm fucking nice. Don't want to see me not be nice. Uh-huh. Yeah, we'll see. Want any fucking dinner? Everything you cook tastes like sawdust anyway. Love you too. surveillance cam in front of the security no. room. You do it today, or you forget about the whole thing. I don't. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. This one's a real charmer, too. Can we get this over with? Why are there three guys? What's she playing at? That's our target, Hiromi Sato. Who are the other two? 
target audience of today's presentation. He owe me answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on my I know face. The claws. To them, power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Maiko! I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? Maiko, our plan made no allowance for witnesses. A show of force, we said. And any show requires an audience. I know how this needs to play out, better than anyone. You gotta trust me. I thought this through many times. Do you think? Well, she is no Barker. Wait, what's going on? Who is this? Living proof that Hiromi Sato's time is up. This merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. He murdered Oswald Forrest. And now he's invaded Mr. Sato's private residence. As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sato's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck's she doing? Clouds needs new management. Am I to understand Hold it? on, Michael. I think you're getting carried away. I see not all has been agreed. V, you gotta take him down. That's why we're here. Bored of all this chatter. I'd rather we just cut to the quick. Oh, fuck you, my... What might that be? They'll have their revenge. You've turned clouds into a ticking time bomb. We can't know that for sure. Maybe the lives we cut short will be enough for the claws. They do profit and loss better than Militech CEO. They'll see it's not worth it. They wipe their hands of the mocks. Maybe clouds is due its freedom now. Time to let it go, Maiko. Get out! Get out now! All right, V, get out of there. Exit's on the lower level of the apartment. Then find the elevator. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Get down to street level. Waiting by the food stalls. Fuck. Should have seen that coming. Probably had this plan from the start. Same sec we walked into her office. Jesus, am I a gonk. Who cares if she was scheming? We did it. That's what matters. Clouds belongs to the dolls now. You are co Right. That was the plan all along. And you made it happen. Thank you. See you later, V. See you around, Judy. Oh, same old. You? 
I got good days, got bad days. Same as ever. You, uh, call just to see how I'm doing, or...? Not just. Got a favor to ask you. Ask away. It's never boring with you. Interesting people aren't easily bored. No chance in your company. But now that we've <laughs> blown each other, what's up? You're on a need-to-know basis. So, this particular mission don't require you to have no gun. Just a wetsuit. All right then, count me in. But I gotta warn you, I look great in a wetsuit. Damn out past Rancho Coronado. Know it? Uh, sure, what about it? Little, uh, abandoned bungalow lakeside. Meet me there. At sundown. Okay. Uh, is this a date? <laughs> You're not my type, Holmes. Just show up. I'll see you there. Maybe. After all that went down, I thought you and I'd be ancient history. Don't be a gunk. So, ready to tell me what we're doing here? Well, been tinkering with virtues a lot lately and figured out a way to scroll two actors' experiences at the same time. Thought we could try it out. If you're down, of course. Sounds like we could do this anywhere. Why do we come all the way out of here? What is this place? Cottage belonged to someone I knew. It sits empty now. I take the liberty to use it from time to time. And that's where we're gonna scroll? No, we're gonna scroll underwater. Nope, no way. Bad idea. Tell her to find some other yes man. What do you say? You in? Hell yeah, I'm in. Awesome. So, uh, let's go. Got the hardware here. All right, suit up, landlubber. Let's get this scroller on ya. Water's toxic. That not a problem? Whole reason we're suiting up. Look pretty damn fine in that wetsuit. Don't go there, dude. All right, let's do this. Freezing ass water, here I come. Okay, we're all set. You go first. Stay close behind me, and don't descend too fast. Where are we headed exactly? About halfway to the deepest point. It'll be pitch black, but the currents are gentle. Ought to be safe. Want the precise coordinates? Nah, why bother? I'll just stick close to you. Okie dokes. Virtues are more to you than just a way to churn out eddies, huh? Well, duh. Think it. Paintings, songs, they're meant to produce emotion responses. Generally how any kind of creativity works, sure. Right, so art's a casing, trigger for emotion. Well, BDs are emotion in near pure form. This 
Gigi. Swim over here and look straight at me, will you? Great. Great. Signal's clear. Just need your help with a few basic checks. Need to calibrate our gear. First up, motion sensors and scrolling. Circle around me. Swim. Great, motion calibrated. Back my way now, V. Next up, sound check. I'm gonna hum a song, you give me the title. Read me. No idea what the song is, but I heard it. Go something like... All right, we're all tuned and synced. All right, that ought to do it. What now? Prepare to have your mind blown. Wait for it. And hold on tight. Down we go. Impressive, huh? What is it? Our very own Atlantis. It used to be called Laguna Bend. Just 15 years ago, people still lived here. Got some connection to this place, right? You got it. Grew up here. Haven't been back since Laguna Bend was wiped off the map. Why are you showing me this? Wanna get the right emotional reactions. Got a feeling this will be perfect for my experiment. Sounds Nova. Let's do this. Played this moment coming back so many times in my head. Taking me years. Working up the nerve for this. Why didn't you come earlier? Good question. Easy answer would be that I didn't have time, gear, stars weren't ever aligned. The truth is, the very idea just felt weird. Best eatery in town? Only one at that, too. Burgers weren't amazing, too greasy. Big. Of course, I say that now. Back then, they were the best thing I'd ever chewed and swallowed. And next door, that's where we lived. Me and my grandparents. Just let me know when you want to forge ahead. Looks like this fell off your one and only eatery. Now, let's see. Childhood for you tasted like... toasted marshmallows. And they always caught fire, burned. But that never bothered you. I don't even know anymore. It's hard to separate actual memories from what you want to remember. Well, our brains weren't built with perfect memory. Got something here. Looks like an old photo cam. DPI 350. Practically.
practically an antique. You like it? You kidding? It's awesome. A hockey stick. Is there a skating rink here? I wish. Played street hockey on rollerblades. Quit smoothing out for you. place for a framed picture. Water probably carried it out of someone's house. Anything to make out? No, not much. Sitting here collecting algae. Gosh, thanks. Let's keep going, Judy. Aye, aye, Captain. Follow me. We looking for anything in particular here? No. Can't hurt to look around, though. Picking up very chill vibes. It feels like we're outside of time, like in a snow globe. After that, we can see what lies up ahead. get why they left their wheels behind when they had to evacuate. Hey, how old do you think I am? These hunks of metal have got half a century on them. When I was about yay high, they were already here. And not in much better shape. It's good cover for playing Max Tack and Psychos, though. Hard to imagine anything that could be more out of place in an underwater world. Hmm. Bottled water? Touche, Judy. Touche. What, this isn't yours? Poor thing. Been here all alone for 20 years. So it is yours. No. It was Jenny Chapman's. Took her doll. As if. Hit it. It was a monster. You hit it? Why? Because I thought only losers played with dolls. What I really wanted was for her to notice me. Ah, the days when dolls were just kids' toys and nothing else. Want to see what's further on? Come on, then. Want to show you something. Got no idea how weird it feels swimming through here. Where you used to run as a kid, where deadly life grinded along, <laughs> can imagine it a bit. <laughs> Church hasn't aged at all. It always looked old and like it had landed here from outer space. Bells were cracked too. I gave off this eerie, atonal clang. Weird, I had no memory of that second ago. Now I can almost hear him. I don't know how it's possible, but I think I hear those bells too. Seriously? You can hear my memories? It must be a side effect. Ah, closed. Shame. 
could look for another way inside. Be my guest. Did you like going to this church? Never actually went to church. Never even really paid attention to it. It was just there, you know? Once we knew Laguna Bend was... And this, what is it? Oh, no way. Can't be. You found the heart of Laguna Bend. The most precious gem in all Cali, maybe even the world. Could buy all of Arasaka and Militech and then some for it. For real? <laughs> nah, I got no idea what that is. Found an opening. I think we're safe to go through here. On my way. Snuck in here once when no one was around. Stood at the altar and tried to imagine what went through the Padre's mind looking at all those people. Back then I wondered how he could read people's thoughts know everything about him. Then I screamed at the top of my lungs to check the acoustics. He, he didn't get chased off? Ran out myself. Echo, I got back scared because of the Jesus of me. Thought it was that crush I had on Jenny Chapman. All that guilt I tried yelling out flew right back in my face. Ah! V, please. Oh, thank oh, fuck. fuck. You're alive. How'd you manage to lift me out? Don't know, didn't think about it. Just did what I had to do. Hey, careful, easy now. So, you're saying you saved my life. Thank you. Told you diving into this toxic waste was gonna end badly. But you just don't fucking listen. Toxic waste? Is that your construct? You heard him? Uh, herds overstating. It's just surfaced in my head. A thought that wasn't mine or completely yours. Please just ignore his babbling. It's a complicated relationship. Why do I even bother? Doubt you should go back to the city just now. I'm pretty beat too. Last thing I want to do is drive. Let's stay the night. What do you think? Why the hell not? Whose cottage is that then? You said you knew the owner. One of our neighbors was hell bent on staying in Laguna Bend. Padges literally dragged him out of his house before the water came in. So he built himself another house as close as he possibly could, but then he got sick. Water was way more toxic back then. Must be chilled to the bone. I'll brew a pot. How do you take yours? Uh, black, please. 
Like the heart of a merc. Ah, forgot to start the generator. I can turn it on. You're gonna take it easy. Promise to take it slow. All those people from the town. It's depressing. Most nomads have a story like that. And all of them began with the same thing. Displacement. Power's up. Judy? What was that? Couldn't hear you clearly. Something the matter? No, nothing. Don't bullshit me, Judy. We're still synced, remember? Clouds has gone to shit. Tiger Claw no next took revenge for Hiromi and the rest. There was a firefight. Tom's dead. Roxanne barely got out alive. House is closed until further notice. I'd rather not talk or think about it. Didn't want to tell you. Didn't want you to think I blame you in any way. Why would you even assume I'd think that? Dunno, I... I'm sorry. Let's just kill the subject. I think I'll go lie down. I'm beat. It's on my nerves. That's you and me below. Just don't wake her up. You fucking blow if you can. Not about to leave her alone, middle of nowhere. No, I can't talk to you when you get this. Sentimental. Waste of words. At least take a nap so we don't have to argue. Will you sit with me a while? Here's your coffee. Finally. Morning. You know, yesterday I think I'd made up my mind. I actually called you because I wanted to say goodbye. City's chewed me up. And spit me out. Fuck, Judy. You're saying you want to leave. Now. You know, I had this bizarre combo with a doll. Told me I had to fight. And I thought, fight for what? 
And now, just when I thought I knew what it was all for, friendship, trust, you're telling me you're leaving. It's not like we won't keep in touch. Give me your hand, V. All set, congrats. Just gave you unlimited access to my pad. Whoa, you're asking me to move in? If it's what you want. Or just drop by when the urge grabs you. Don't know what to say. Nobody's ever done anything like this for me. It really shows trust. Take care, V. Is this really it? The last time we see each other. Didn't seem so set on leaving just a sec ago. See no reason to delay. I'll stay here a couple days, then head off. It's been nice knowing you, V. See ya. And... Hit me up on the hollow sometimes. I'll see you, Judy. <laughs>